Yes, ladies and gentlemen, this is true. This is not clickbait, trust me. Tails the Fox got his own scene in the new Sonic the Hedgehog movie. Is poison. What's happening, everybody? My name is Mr. Mario, and welcome to another video. Now, there have been some big news going around lately about the Sonic the Hedgehog movie that got introduced in 2019, and then it got, in then it got introduced to the public in theaters in February 14th of this year. My, I myself was lucky enough to go and see this movie on the first showing day. But what really surprised everybody was the post credit scene. Now, every movie has its own post credit scene. So, it wasn't very surprising that this movie wasn't going to have one, but it shocked social media. It shocked the whole world and Sonic fans alike. It even shocked me. If you were in the theaters when I was there, dude, I, you can tell I was freaking out. So, yeah. <clears throat> Tails the Fox got his own scene in the Sonic the Hedgehog movie. No one was expecting it. Today, we are going to review the clip and go over some secrets and some theories that we have about the clip. Now, the video I'm going to show you here is actually filmed from a camera from someone in the audience that was holding their phone actually filming the entire movie and then they ended up posting this scene, which is very illegal, but you gotta do what you gotta do, right? <laughs> so, yeah, I'm sorry if the audio and quality is pretty bad, but... Hundreds of people did the same exact thing this person did. So, ladies and gentlemen, here is the clip of the Sonic the Hedgehog movie of 2020 that shocked the entire world. Let's take a look. If these readings are accurate, he's here. I found him. I just hope I'm not too late. <laughs> Now, if you couldn't really understand what he was saying, he said, if these re uh, he said, if these readings are accurate, he's here. I found him. I just hope I'm not too late. Now, that's a big mystery to most people that watch the movie, including me. Because, as if you don't know, this movie was based on a time period where Sonic didn't meet up with Tails. He was basically a lion when he moved into the human world. So, why is he looking for Sonic? He doesn't even know him yet. Maybe he's trying to look for a source of power like Dr. Robotnik was. We don't really know yet. It's kind of a mystery. Now guys, we're not even close to done with how much stuff is hidden in this post credit scene. Now, just a reminder, I have the link to the person who posted this video it might be deleted by then, but I don't know, but just in case, go down below and check it out. But we're not even nowhere near done because this trailer holds a lot that we haven't really found out yet. So let's keep going. Now another thing I've been wondering, and a lot of people have been wondering, is what Tails would have looked like before they redid Sonic because the community was complaining he looked too weird to be, like, considered a Sonic. <laughs> so, ugh, yeah. Man, I still get nightmares about that. I'm actually kind of glad they didn't go with the before scene and movie design of Sonic, you know what I mean? Because that would have became the biggest meme on social media at that time. It already has been the biggest meme on social media at that time, but it would have gone way bigger by now. Yeah. Another thing people have been wondering about, even though it's only been two days from the time this video has been made, when the movie Tails came out, is a possible sequel. And he said that he hoped it's not too late to find Sonic. And he was looking for Sonic. So, in the next movie, if they have a sequel, they might, he might find Sonic and pair up with him. And since 
there was another scene where Dr. Robotnik turned into his more cartoonish version whenever he was banished to the mushroom on mushroom planet by Sonic. So, yeah. Sequel, anybody? I mean, they just can't announce my boy Tails at the end of the movie for 30 seconds without having a sequel. I mean, <laughs> if you didn't already tell by now, I'm actually a big fan of Tails. Don't look at me. I'm not weird. You're weird. Amy fans. I see you through there. I'm watching you. Hey, that reminds me of another thing. Possible sidekicks. Well, now you've seen the Sonic Boom, um, cartoons and games. There has to be a chance that the movie will announce Knuckles, Six, and Amy. If you think about it, it seems pretty likely. We had Tails so far, and we had Echidna's at the beginning of the movie raid the town of Longclaw and Baby Sonic. So, who knows, this could turn into a big trilogy where they could find Amy and they could find Knuckles. Heck, that could be a good storyline for the sequel to the Sonic the Hedgehog movie we have out right now in theaters. At the beginning, it shows baby Sonic being looked after an owl named Longclaw, who looked after Sonic when he was a baby. But then their town got raided by echidnas, and they had to, and Longclaw sent Sonic out with a bag of rings. She then told him that anywhere he thought of, when he threw a ring, he could teleport to. So whenever he left, Longclaw gave him the bag, that way he could escape if any of the humans got hold of his power. So, how did Tails get a hold of one of these rings? I know they're all over Green Hills soon, but how? I mean, there were specific rings that Longclaw gave Sonic, but how did Tails get hold of these rings? How did Tails even get to the human world? It's one of those things you have to really sit down and think about before you actually understand it. You know what I mean? And the original story of how Sonic met up with Tails was Tails was getting bullied at school by his extra with his extra tail. And then Tails went off to find someone who could look after him. And then he ran to Sonic that was running along the hills. And then he just met up with him and became friends. But that doesn't really seem to be playing any part here. Maybe he's looking for him to become his friend. Who knows? Like I said, no one really knows. It's kind of unexplainable. So the mystery of Tails the Orange Kitsune that appeared in the movie is still a big mystery to the world and is leaving people go crazy, like myself, thinking about what is going to happen next or if they're going to have a second movie. Let me know what you guys think down below about this. Um, kind of an elaborate video, but we've covered all the mysteries and all of the theories that people had about this ending, this 30 second ending of Tales appearing in the Sonic the Hedgehog movie of 2020. Anyway guys, yeah, like I said, comment below on what you think will happen and if they will have a trilogy even, like a bunch of movies coming out that will focus on Sonic, which I think would be really awesome. Let me know what you think. I just want to hear all your comments and all your thoughts about this movie. Anyway, make sure you click the like button if you enjoyed this video and subscribe to the channel to never miss another video again. Go check out my other videos that aren't really like like this. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Later.